Hi everybody, this is Little Egypt checking in and this time we have with us Mike Lano. I'm so excited to introduce you to him because he brings with him a well of information. Tell us about what your thoughts are here at the CAC. You come every year and you're not just a supporter of wrestling, but you also write about wrestling and chronologically explain wrestling to people who aren't really familiar with this. Tell us a little bit about that, Mike. True. Well, actually, I worked with Art Abrams. I've been coming since 1986 and was the associate club photographer since 87 and haven't missed a CAC. Uh, it's, we're celebrating our 50th this year. But I, uh, I used to run fan clubs in the early, early 60s when I was a kid for the Sheik, Freddie Blassie, and the Tolis Brothers. In 1966, I started working for the West and Bill After magazines, and I've written and shot for every newsstand magazine around the world, including now 10 years at uh, DirecTV's magazine, where I cover your industry, Hollywood, and all these things going on. But uh, I have to say, Maria Menounos and her partner were just so gracious and lovely to everybody at WrestleMania Hall of Fame just a couple of weeks ago in Silicon Valley and um, she does so well. I mean, uh, she's got to be a Stern Show regular, Howard Stern Show regular. But seeing uh, the Glow women who are such a part of the family of wrestling, it's been, and I think you put that together, you and maybe Cheryl in Hollywood, uh, you are part of us and part of our family. And it's, it's so great having the women of wrestling here, the original divas, as Cheryl wisely pointed out. Uh, and it's another sellout turnout for Cauliflower Alley. And uh, just an amazing array of people here, and it's not even really, uh, you know, the big day, the bologna blowout or the uh, banquet. Right. Well, I'm excited to be here, and then we're going to have, it's a three-day event. The Cauliflower Alley is a nonprofit organization. Uh, in addition to working collectively with the real estate, com uh, with the wrestling community, we also have what we call a benevolent fund. Do you want to tell us a little bit about oh, that? Yeah. Well, Cauliflower Alley has helped innumerable wrestlers, usually, you know, quiet, uh, quietly, which is the proper way to do it. So many wrestlers have benefited and people down on their luck or needing health care or just a, a, a little bit of help because they didn't have insurance insurance or Kios or Iris, things you talked about so well a couple of years ago in your outstanding presentation on life after wrestling and marketing oneself, which people today know, but uh, our brothers and, and sisters in the 40s, 50s, 60s never got that help. And uh, CAC is really, to my mind, the only organization in the world that helps others. And that's its core mission statement. And they've been doing it now 50 years. Well, it's our 50 year. So excited that you're here. This is Little Egypt again signing out for another awesome interview here at the Gold Coast Hotel, Las Vegas, Nevada. Um, this is Little Egypt, and I'm going to buzz you later.